I'm Billabate, and this is Dark Conflict, and we are here with this lovely thrasher of a ship. It's an engineer ship. Lovely. It's got teeth. It's got windows. It's got cannons. It's got thrusters. Humongous, lovely thrusters. It's got ramming potential that you've never seen before. And it can chew you up. Anyways, we're here to see how you should play this ship. How I think you should play this ship. How I think everyone should play this ship. Let's go ahead and go over the little lovely features of the uh, Thrasher. Anyway, going down to the little weapon, we got a kinetic weapon of a Ripper. 1-7 or 17. I just like to call it 1-7. Anyway, um, I would recommend going for a high deep, not a high DPS. Don't go for high DPS. Fuck high TPS. Anyways, let's go for a high damage. Damage potential. Um, go for a high crit. Just a high crit. Try to get some crit bonus in that. Uh, every time you hit someone's ship, though, it, it drops a uh, little health package to maximize your strength of your hull for 5% and can stack up up to 5 times, and that can last up to 60 seconds. I believe... It can also reset the timer every time you pick it up. So you can keep on having those five stacks every time you pick it up. So, anyways, going down to the lovely ram attack or warp gate ram, ML17. Uh, it sets up a little gate and it's a little delayed when you go into the gate. It slowly, like, increases speed. So you might want to kind of just get a feel for that it, it's hard to get used to and what you're what you're putting yourself in is a uh, danger pretty much when you do this because you're you're chasing after someone that's probably in the uh in their safe field let's say uh, i would only use this for like big destroyers if they're half health you can instantly kill them sometimes i'm not joking if they're half if their hole is half health doesn't matter if they have shield their hole is half health do it you might kill them i'm not gonna fucking lie but you should also get some uh focus on your hole strength because uh i think it's because it's an empire so it's really good at hole fuck the shield go for that increased speeds so you can escape and do a warp gate Hopefully you can warp gate. You can also pick something else that maybe works better for you. Maybe the cloud for better survivability. I like to just hit and run, hit and run, hit and run. So hit, run, hit, run. Anyways, we're going to go for some energy regeneration. Uh, honestly, uh, you could go for something else, but... You know, you're trying to hit and run, and the boosters takes a lot of little, uh, a lot of energy. So, yeah, the hole, you can, uh, you can play around with it. Uh, don't go for too much for this, or else you're losing effect. The more resist points you get, the, the lower the percentage it goes. And I like to hit the 50% spot, or either the 40% bot. So, spot, anyways. It's got 40% resist on everything, which I think that's perfection. And the crystal plate increases it from there. Anyways, and I liked, I went with regenerating coating for that surplus energy. That also helps me, this also helps, this also helps that a little bit. A uh, little high crit damage, blah, 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 high crit. Let's join a pvp and show you what this lovely scary fucking thing hello welcome back this is bill of eight this is gonna be a voiceover anyways we're gonna go ahead and skip to the little tiny sections of how this ramming potential works and how it just kills the loving shit of the destroyer so far i only killed two destroyers 
in this video, sadly. The ship is very hard, I'm not gonna lie. It's very frustrating to aim the ramming module, but once you aim it, you can instant kill anything, to be honest. Kill anything. So we're just gonna go to the, you know, good ramming potential, good little ramming complications, little things, you know. Anyways, back to the video. So this is gonna be one of the ramming things I've done. Here we are. I win every time because I'm the best. Oh my god. Oh my god. Did I just destroy a fucking... <sighs> what in the hell? That's how you killed two destroyers. It's all right, they're not. They're... Oh, we got a destroyer. We can destroy. So this is a good opportunity to get that destroyer. But the bad thing is, is he's got shields. I can't really charge after him. But it looks like he doesn't have shields. So, but he's a little, we're gonna be alone, so we can't really charge into that. Wait for him to get, he's also got shields. Go from below and try to attack him from below. Boom! Alrighty, thank you for watching the video. Uh, if y'all wanna watch more Star Conflict videos, I have some videos that you can lovely watch. Some of them is like four years ago or five years ago. So be just gentle with my uh, production because it's it's all right anyways i hope to see y'all soon and see y'all in the next video bye bye